the seed and the bracket and your first round matchup. Um, I was, you know, I was happy, you know, to see that we had a two seed. Um, you know, I think we, we deserve it. You know, we worked hard, you know, this season. Um, but I think, you know, we're in a good, we're in a good position. You know, Santa Barbara first. You know, UCLA, Michigan, Michigan State next. Um, we just got to come ready to play. They've got a six-five guard that's their leading scorer. Sounds like a matchup uh, that, that you may have to take on. And just talk a little bit about defending bigger guards too. What you do to try to compensate. Uh, pretty much. I try to uh, pressure. I try to pressure as much as I can so, you know, they don't get a shot off. You know, you know, I don't know what kind of player he is, if he's running off screens or if he's getting out the dribble. But, you know, I'm going to do my best, you know, to disrupt what he has going on. I don't know how much you guys maybe close out ESPN or some other things. But just some people sitting around say, ah, four is not worthy of a two seed. They were overrated. Charles Barkley said that during the six. I don't know if you listen to that or is that something maybe that you guys could use as fuel or what do you think? Uh, we had left, so we really didn't hear it. But uh, I heard, you know, a lot of people saying, you know, we didn't deserve to see. But honestly, I mean, whether we were a two seed or a six seed, you know, it really doesn't mean anything. I uh, just think, you know, every game we got to come out and play. Is there any difference to you, or, or what's the difference to you going in this year versus last year? Just, you know, 10, happy to get in, we're on the bubble. Um, I think last year, you know, we went in and we, we got complacent that we were in the tournament. You know, we, um, we didn't know exactly, you know, how good, you know, BYU was or, you know, how good Jimmy for that was, you know. Um, when we got in the game, I think we played hard, but I think, you know, um, for us to prepare, we didn't prepare, you know, the right way rather than this year. You know, we've been there before. You know, this year we're going to prepare to win and go deep into the tournament. You know, you guys both win. you would be right back in his grill in the third round. <laughs> Who was that? BYU. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, you noticed yeah, I definitely that, didn't seen you? That. Yeah, I definitely seen that. But uh, we definitely got both, you know, win out. You might be trying to put 50 on it. <laughs> 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 okay, yeah. Obviously, you'd love to be there, though, because that means you both wouldn't be winning. And yeah, like definitely, another shot at them? Yeah, definitely love to be there. I mean, um, you know, they're a good team. You know, they're still good. You know, but if, that, if we do beat up, you know, we both got to come to play. Did you learn anything about how to approach tur- – that? Th- is there a different approach to tournament games? Did you learn that last year, and, and does that apply this year? Um, I think – you got, you got to be more focused because whether you play um, UCLA, you know, or, you know, Santa Barbara, I think, you know, uh, Santa Barbara, you know, they have nothing to lose, so they're going to come out and play their hardest. You know, there's it, a lot of upsets in um, NCAA games, so you definitely got to come out, you know, and play, you know, a good first half. Is it, is it-